Hi Vogue, it's Hailey Bieber. Today I'm going to be showing you guys what I wear in a week. Okay, so this is my cozy, comfy, athleisure look. This is definitely something I would love to fly in or maybe for even a long road trip. To start, I wouldn't be in hotel slippers, so I'm going to take these Nike SBs, fold those up like that because I just think it looks cooler. And then I'm going to put it with this cool like charcoal gray coat that is from La Mer. I love a really long sleeve on a coat. It's everything to me. I love this sweatshirt because it's like a little bit worn and it's vintage, but it is that yummy fleece on the inside. So this look for me is more of a, like a New York style look when it starts to get chilly there. I love these Margiela pants. I've had them for a long time. I love the way that they fit. This is a very cozy cashmere Bottega Veneta sweater. I feel like I'm gonna be able to have this sweater for 20 years and it's never gonna go out of style and my kids can steal it from me one day. I used to steal a lot of sweaters from my mom when I was younger. She had like this amazing cashmere sweater collection. I'm going to do this really cool red Saint Laurent coat. <clears throat> me trying to get things off the rack without knocking a million things over. So I am obsessed with this coat. It's gonna be my coat of the season. I'm gonna go with these Alexander Wang heeled booties. <laughs> Please excuse me while I try to get these on, but you wanted to see how I really get myself dressed, so this would be what it's like. One. It didn't rip, it didn't rip, it's just the sound of the pants. That's the one thing about this material is it's a little bit loud, especially if you like sit down in them or sit on like a leather seat and you're just like, it's just the pants, I swear. And I'm going to pair it with this YSL bag. I love this necklace in general, I'm just not sure if I want it with this outfit, but I think I like it with this for sure. When I was buying this coat, I decided to go up two sizes just to first of all feel cozy, but second of all, when you're trying to put sweaters and more bulkier things underneath them, just so you have more room to do that. So bag, coat, necklace, good to go. So this is my kind of day to night look and these pants are my like favorite thing of the season right now. They're by the brand Kate, which I really, really love. I just love the way that they fit. I love the length of them. I love the little split at the side so you can wear them with a flat shoe and they're flattering or you can wear them with a heel and they're super flattering. This little bralette I also really love. It's by Jock Moose. Simon, don't kill me. I mispronounced it. I wear a lot of blazers. I think blazers are an essential part of anybody's wardrobe, at least a really good staple black one or gray one or a neutral colored one. This is from Magda Bertram. This one you can see kind of comes in at the waist. Cinches here is a little bit more flattering. I'm gonna pair it with these white Tom Ford heels. I love that they're a little pop of white. I think it's super cute. I think I would go with probably this white jock mousse. So it's like a pop of white and a pop of white together. Throw it over my shoulder. I feel very like business chic in this outfit. It feels very like mature but cool. I love it. And call it a day tonight. So this is my date night look and I went with a cute little black dress. That's usually my favorite go-to for any type of going out or date night situation. I love heels that have straps like that that go around the ankle. I think it's really sexy. Let's say it was maybe chilly in the evening. I would pair this with this Marina Moscone one. It actually hits a very similar length to the dress and I think it brings a cool little edge to the outfit and since it's an all black outfit I like a little pop of color with it. I think it's always fun to get dressed up for date night and even just get dressed up for each other and 
and nobody else. I wouldn't say husband is too overly picky about anything I wear. I think he just feels like if I feel good in it, then he likes it too. So this is a black Wolford bodysuit and a pair of blue jeans. I'm gonna start with this Zara belt. Bet you've never seen someone struggle so hard to put on a belt. Check it. Yep. Belt. I'm gonna put this coat with it. And this coat is from a brand called Ray. I hope I'm saying that right, and please don't be mad at me if I'm not. I'm not sure 100% about the shoes. I'm gonna try probably two different things. I'm gonna do one boot on one side, and these boots are, I think, like a must staple in anybody's closet, and they're from the row. And then I'm probably gonna just put a sneaker on the other foot and see what I like better. I think I'm feeling the boots, so I'm gonna go with the boots. I'm gonna do this YSL bag with it because I love this bag. I use this bag a ton. I feel like it's a great everyday grab and go type of bag. I think it's really cute. I think it's simple. I think it's practical. I like it. So this is my casual Saturday look and I am wearing these really cool baggy Natasha Zinko jeans that I love. They're a little bit more tomboy. I've been photographed in these jeans quite a few times. They're my favorite fit. I love these ones. I don't care to repeat them. This sweater is from Mango. It's so easy to just throw on. It's a great color. I would definitely do sneakers. So I'm gonna do these white Air Force Ones. I wear these sneakers like literally every day. I think the way you can keep something really casual, really chic, is the way that you accessorize it or dress it up. Because it's such a casual outfit, I like to elevate it with a cool bag. I particularly like this adorable little baby Prada bag, and I like the color. I know people always see me wearing a bun. I know people are tired of it, but sometimes I'm just lazy and I don't feel like doing my hair. So that, throw on a little baseball hat. This one says, I am a voter, which I am, and you should be too. Hopefully you're registered. Hopefully you're gonna get out there and vote. It's so important. Please do it. So this is my Sunday look, and this is a look that I would do at home if we were having people over, hosting Sunday dinner. Recently decided we're gonna do a once a month pizza night at our house. I don't have shoes on right now because if I was gonna wear this at home, I'd probably just be barefoot. We have a no shoes rule in our house, which I've never been too picky about shoes in the house, but my husband does not like it. I like that it almost looks like pajamas, but it's a little bit more elevated. I love a matching set. This one is by Nanushka, which is another brand that I really, really love. You know, I have my days where I like to be a bit more girly, a bit more grown up, and then I have my days where I like to be a bit more tomboy, and I feel like this is like the opposite end of the spectrum of tomboy for me. Thank you, Vogue. That was what I wear in a week. I hope you guys enjoyed this video. I hope maybe you were able to pick up some tips or um, inspired to try something a little bit different with your style. I'll see you next time.